a lot of the coaches, Trestle, Schneider, D'Antonio have all braved that you had a great spring. Mm -hmm. Schneider said that's translating into this fall. Mm -hmm. How comfortable do you feel running that defense? I feel very comfortable. A lot more comfortable than I did uh, last year and even more comfortable than I did in the spring right now. Uh, I feel confident. I feel like I know what I'm doing and that makes the, my ability to play faster and I'm looking forward to this upcoming season. Are you not thinking, you're just reacting? I think I think that has to do with it. I mean, that just comes with reps and practice and over and over again and just, just doing what you need to be and being where you have to be. And, you know, and I'm getting more comfortable as the days go by. Max is busy with the NFL, but he still takes time to look oh, yeah, out for I, you. I'm definitely in contact with Max all the time. He's always there to help me with whatever I need, and same goes for Riley. What advice does he give you? Uh, you know what? I think it, it extends beyond the football field with Max and his advice to me. Definitely Riley's going through the same things I am right now, so I talk to him more on a football level, I'd say, but Max, Max is always there for me as well. What have you seen out of some of these younger linebackers and the way they're progressing? I think uh, some of it's just fantastic seeing these younger linebackers do some things that mentally, you know, I don't even think I was doing freshman year, definitely not. Uh, definitely just picking up the defense more. Bocce's doing a tremendous job right now uh, as the mic and you know I'm excited for our, our young linebackers. Reschke's a guy that you know you're familiar with. How have you seen him progress this fall camp? Man Reschke's having a tremendous fall camp. Uh, you could definitely see him improve his tackling form this spring and it just keeps getting better and better um, as his fall camp goes by and the sky's the limit for John. Ed is a guy that's going to get work back in the rotation, but how has he helped you off the field? Ed is just a tremendous guy, you know, he's always there, always a friendly guy for me, is here for when anyone's in need. Um, yeah, he's trying to get back, get back on the field, and we'll be ready for him to get back whenever it is. We got a tremendous freshman defensive line class comes in. What have you seen out of, you know, those guys? Man, there's they're some physical guys up front. Uh, I always did a great job recruiting this class. Uh, they're just physical freaks, and you know, they're picking up the defense right now, and you just see flashes, and you're like, whoa, that was a hell of a play. You know, it's exciting, and there's definitely going to be some contributors this year. Is there a particular play that kind of stands out for you from one uh, of them? If I, I think Mike Panusiak is really, he's an animal. Uh, he's doing real well right now in fall camp, and I'm excited to see him keep learning the defense and continue to play faster. We'll see what happens. How does that make the linebacker core job a little bit easier when you got guys uh, like when that? You got, D-line always makes the linebacker's job easier. I mean, just filling gaps, being able to hold the point. Uh, it's something you're excited as a linebacker to see when you got a bunch of bunch of studs up front. After interviewing you after the loss to Alabama, you said you wanted to step up more as a leader. Mm -hmm. How have you stepped up as a leader? I think I've stepped up in not only uh, with my actions, but in my words a little bit. You know, I, I continue to, to feel myself growing as a leader, uh, just getting guys on the same page, definitely playing the mic position. You're in a position where you need to be a leader, and you know my, my role has continued to grow. How has that loss motivated this team? I think it's still in the back of our minds a little bit. We're ready. We're in the teens days until kickoff now, and you know I think it still eats at us a little bit, and we're just ready to go out there and compete again. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm.